Yeah, I might as well just turn this shit into a storm for a rant because they they bullshitting every time. I'm looking at this interview from this nigga. What's his fucking name? Hiroshi Matsuyama. Yeah, that's his fucking name. He said the what this nigga say. Hold on, let me see, let me see, let me see, let me see. The first big change you'll notice in the game. Hold on. Is the colors and the general feel of the game. The colors and the general feel of the game. Nigga, you're playing on the level that's been in this game since, I think, Storm 3. That's three games ago, nigga. It looks exactly the same as when it first came out. The colors and the general feel of the game. What else does this nigga say? Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Several changes thanks to the high specs. High spec. It looks the same. It just looks like there's DLC characters in the game. It, it looks like an update. Hold on. It. Oh my god. Niggas say, niggas say it looks different because they're playing with brand new characters. That's the only thing. That's what you look at when you're playing a storm game. You don't look at the fucking building and try to fight a nigga. You look at your character and the opponent's character to try to see how the fuck you gonna beat that ass. You got two niggas playing as two different fucking characters. Like, oh, it looks different. Of course it looks different because that's the only thing you're looking at. I mean, you can look around, but you're playing on a level that's been in the game since Storm 3. Why do I still need to look around? The only change is, is that there's not fucking stacks of boxes and pile of leaves. That's it. But that's been taken out from the last game. So so what are you what are you telling me? What are you telling me? We put more effort into the combos and animation effects, yet there's only three combos still. And they're even more satisfying. How? How? But the biggest aspect of this game's battle system is... What? What is it? What is it? New leader change system. Now, I don't know what you gotta do to do that, but, you know, I've seen that you just slide on out. What, what, what can probably, probably be cool, like I'm saying, this game would be a lot better if you played with people with good internet. You know, we could do, I don't know, about a 3v3 or something like that, but a 2v2. You know, like a tech and tag team system. You beating somebody ass and you switch out to your homie. But if your homie got a shit-ass internet connection and you switch out to the nigga, you just gonna be standing there like, what the fuck? And then he gonna come up in there lagging and shit, fucking up everything. So, I don't, I don't know, two, I don't know, two, 2v2, 3v3s. That would be cool, but that's some Mario Party shit. That's the type of shit you gotta call your homies over to your house for and do. You can't do that shit when niggas living in different countries. You can't do it. You can't do it. You can't do it. It's, it's not happening. Okay, so they said it's a limit on how many times you can change. I mean, that's cool and everything, but still. Like, soccer looks a little different. I can't really tell. That shit gonna be tight, though. I mean... I don't know. With the round system, it is like you got four health bars, but... I mean, that's... I, okay, yeah, now that I'm thinking of it, that's pretty cool. Because I was gonna say add in another health bar, but that would have been too much. But yeah, when you do fire-style jutsu, motherfuckers stay on fire. I think I seen that they have a little bit of chip damage, so they'll they'll slowly take damage. And I think I'm talking slower than the poison tags or poison in general in a Naruto game. So yeah. I can't see their health bars as they're doing this, so I can't um I can't really tell how, how slow the damage is. What what else? Doing ninja moves. Oh, okay, so. Look at this nigga thinking that he. Do you see. Oh my god, y'all gotta see this shit. He's like, okay, if you get hit with a fire style jutsu, which um, I think is the only jutsu that has a side effect. 
You know, because cause there's different types. There's five different types or chakra fucking natures. If you get hit with fire, you're going to be on fire. Like, what happens if you get hit with some wind or, or some water or some earth or some lightning? What happens? Or are they only sucking the fire style users' dicks? But anyway, this nigga said, if you get caught on fire, move around and you'll extinguish the flames. And if there's a puddle or water on the stage, walk on top of the water and the fires from up here is going to go away. Okay. That makes... That, you know what? That makes almost too much sense. I, I feel like a dumbass. I feel like a dumbass for thinking that that wouldn't work. I'm sorry. What? You gonna you switch out? Is the other... No. He's not. Okay, he said more natural phenomena than flames. Alright, so shut my ass up. That's good. Y'all think I like talking shit about these games? Y'all think I like that? No, I don't like it. Because these games are actually fun sometimes. But if you've got somebody like me talking shit about the game, bashing it, because they still got shit in from the second game, that's bad. Because if I'm doing all this shit talking and I'm telling the truth, that's bad. I would like for these niggas to shut me the fuck up, but they don't. They do not do it. I say, oh, this, 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 and that is going to be in the game. But why that isn't going to be in the game, I don't know. And they leave that out. Hold on. That's that's too much. They, they got niggas switching out when they awaken. That's too much. That's too much. don't know how much people be sucking dick on this game. That's what it is. They don't know. They don't know. I mean, I understand that you're not supposed to be fucking having fun and playing against niggas like they're your best friend or some shit like that, but still, there's some severe disadvantages in these games, man. That shit is, oh my god, this shit crazy. Man, I don't know what the fuck. And they state they adding niggas in the game, like. Okay. Let me, let, me, let me throw this out there. Two bitches. There's two bitches in this game. With red fucking hair. Red fucking hair. Two bitches in this game with red hair. Full combos. Jutsu, ultimate jutsu, awakening, everything. These bitches. <laughs> these bitches have not been seen. Doing a single thing that they're doing in that game, in the manga or in the show. You got a bitch. You got one bitch spraying niggas with perfume. Though. You got another bitch hitting niggas in the face with a pan, though. But. Niggas in the old games that have been seen fighting in the show and in the manga and in more than one of the previous games are not in this one? Why? Now look, I understand motherfuckers begged and pleaded for the for the fucking what are they Edo Kages? You know the, the dead motherfuckers. They 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 begged and pleaded for them. And not even a lot of people use them. I get that. But who asked for these bitches though? 
second thought. What I think it is, is people would want a bigger character roster. Just because. Just because it's a new game, so they would expect for there to be new characters. Let me tell you this, motherfuckers. One time. One time. There has only been one DLC character. One DLC character from out of all of the game. And I'm not talking about Storm 1 where you could have got the, 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 you know, first, second Hokage as um, support characters. You know, Asuma, Kurenai, them. I'm not talking about them. I'm talking about Sage Mode Kabuto. He is the only motherfucker that we got. Five games, one character that not even a lot of people use. But you telling me, I, I don't, I don't get it. Like, I don't know. I don't know. It's the dumbest shit. We got one character out of five games. We got some characters that we ain't even want. And, and you know, you got people still begging for the seven ninja swordsmen of the mist. Now, if they were to put them in here, or uh, Genkaku and Kenkaku, not a lot of people going to play as them. Like I just said, they just want a bigger character roster, but they're not even going to play them. They're not even going to play as that. They're going to play as the same people that they've been playing with from the previous game because they've been in every game so far and they haven't changed. So when niggas master a character and they make it their main, it's going to stay that way because nobody fucking really changes like that, you know? So if somebody fucking main character was was PTS Naruto in Storm One, guess what? That's their main today because he ain't fucking changed, you know? Bullshit. And if they don't take that fucking countering system out, or if they don't do something about that, I swear to God, I'm gonna flip. You know what? I was taking a shit one day and I was thinking like, why, why, why is it that you can use your fucking counter when you have full health? Full subs, full chocolate bar, support characters if you're playing on teams at the ready. Why? 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 That that is that's stupid. I said, you know what? If if your health is down to a certain point or your chakra is down to a certain point where you have no subs, that should be the only time you should be able to counter. But if if if, if you don't read those require requirements, then you can't you can't use that shit. Cause that shit takes away like almost half of a bar and you only got two so and, and and you can count it three times back to back to back in succession so the math like like they're they're not doing the math you know they're not doing the math but what else man because this let me see what else this nigga got to say let me see what both these niggas got to say I'm just looking at the gameplay. I'm not even on. Damn, they be fucking these games up. These games can be, I'm not going to say a lot better, but they can be better, you know? They're little changes. Every game. Every game is little changes. It's little changes. So, you know, it got them this far, though. I can't front. Niggas still buy the games. But. I don't know, man. They, they be bullshit, you know. The nigga Madara still got the same. Same moveset from Re Revolution. Like, niggas can't look me in my face and tell me that I'm wrong about anything. Because these are all facts. They only showing new characters too. They're not showing anybody else because they know they got the same fucking movie. That's what they do. They 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 push all this new shit in your face. Like, oh look at this new boss battle. Oh look at these new characters. You know, people be like, oh my god, they're new, so everybody else is new. No, no. They shove all these new shit, shove all this new shit in your face, having you think that the whole game is completely different. But no, only the character is completely different. They're playing on the level that's been in Storm 3, three games ago. What are you doing? I'm done. I, I mean, I think I'm done. I don't know if I'm a rant no more, but I'm done.